Welcome to the Windows channel and um, in another look at the uh, April 2018 update. One of the things that has uh, moved ahead quite a lot in this uh, new version of Windows 10 is something that has to do with Fluent Design. We have seen Fluent Design uh, appear, of course, with the Fall Creators update uh, slowly but surely, but in the April 2018 update. Fluent Design is moved ahead to apps and to different uh, sections of the Windows 10 operating system. So, for example, this is the um, Mail app. Look at the uh, Fluent Design acrylic on the left side. Makes it more beautiful, more interesting to look at. Um, even Edge has Fluent Design now. You see it here at the top. There's some acrylic transparencies. There's some in the taskbar. Um, even, you know, if you go to the notifications panel, you can see that the acrylic of Fluent Design is now there. You can also see that the control panel or the settings panel, uh, I still have that whole name in my head, um, also has beautiful um, design for the Fluent Design. So all of that is making the Windows 10 uh, operating system interesting and more beautiful. But what about you know, some of you, and, and, and I've heard from people saying, but you know what, the Fluent Design is not good for me because i got some um, problems with, you know, um, looking at the screen, watching the screen, got some, some eye problems. And um, so you might want to turn it off to make it easier to read. So if you do want to uh, change or remove the Fluent Design, uh, you simply go to your Settings panel, go into Personalization, when you're there, you can go into Colors, and you will see something just below Colors that says Transparency Effects. If you turn that off, Fluent Design will be going away. As you see, it disappear now from the panel, from the settings, from everywhere. So a uh, little switch, very easy to turn it on or off, to uh, remove the Transparency Effects if you don't want them. So uh, Fluent Design, moving ahead with Acrylic. Still some um, little problems with, you know, the consistencies of the interface. Um, not the same everywhere, but I think slowly they're trying to fix that by, um, you know, kind of reimagining and redoing uh, the different um, interface and the different parts of Windows 10. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.